G'day tradies, welcome to another BCM Tough Test. I'm Jamie Gray and today we've got an awesome new product from Conform to look at. So guys at Conform produce an awesome uh, alternative to the traditional timber or plywood formwork for concrete pours. So the beauty of this system is the plastic comes in different sizes. You can create some beautiful curves. Uh, it's lightweight. Uh, you're not carrying around the same amount of weight on big trucks when you've got to set up for a formwork or a concrete pour each time. And I guess some of the other other advantages is you don't need the power tools that you would need fixing nails, shooting in nails, um, screws, things so it's like that. lightweight, it's much faster to set up uh, with the use of these cool little tools which we'll have a look at in a minute uh, and generally speaking you're not going to get anywhere near as many splinters so why don't, don't we jump in and we'll have a closer look. This bracket and peg system is definitely a, uh, a highlight of the system so you can see here how that locks in. It's got a little groove in the back of the board here so to put the little bracket in, it's simply just a matter of putting, putting it into in place, twisting, you can see there that's locked in. You can slide that up behind the peg and then by pulling that handle all the way around, there we go. So that's, that's locked in place there and mate, that really speeds the system up and removes any need for screws or nails. Um, mate, it's a fantastic little system. There you go. So I'm here with my good mate Daryl Thompson from Daryl Thompson Concreting. How you going, legend? Good, mate. Good. Good to see you. Mate, how long have you been concreting for? It's been, what, a long time now? Yeah, be over 15 years now. Perfect. And yeah. you've been seeing a little bit of the uh, conform around the place, you said? I have, yeah, yeah. Actually, poured a house slab uh, Friday, actually, that used the conform uh, in a bend around a um, bay window area. That seems to be, amongst other things, one of the key strengths, right? That ability to create beautifully yeah. smooth curbs. Yeah, yeah, it's very good for that. Um, as well as doing the straight work as well. Awesome, yeah. awesome. Well, Daryl's going to give us a bit of a hand today. I'm going to uh, I'll do one do side. I'll do the conform side. <laughs> and you can do the traditional side. Now, you've obviously been doing it for a long time, so you're going to be pretty fast, but we'll just see how it compares from one side versus, you know, traditional versus the new conform. Yeah, good. Let's give it a crack. Okay, mate. Beautiful. It does. It was a little bit of a foot race, mate, but I think I just pipped you at the post. What do you reckon? Oh, I think you did more than that, Jamie. I think you uh, <laughs> mate, truly won the race. It's an easy system to put together. I mean, you know, I've only done limited form work myself, but, um, mate, the little brackets clip in really easy. Obviously, we didn't sort of worry too much about measuring that out. We just wanted to show how the product came together, but there's no denying the speed of the system, right? Oh, totally. Especially, uh, I noticed that the joins are very easy to get together as opposed to, Mate, to you know, yeah, the little or, the little yeah, universal joint. Yeah. You just literally just slide yeah, it into they just the mold together, and then it's all one piece yep. from there. You know. Yep. Excellent. Yeah. And I guess the flexibility of that nice little end bit there, um, you couldn't even come close to you replicating the no, bend. I broke two boards and trying to get <laughs> the, even half the curve you've got. So. Yep. And I guess the best thing is. Um, I didn't need to use any power tools, so there was no impact driver, there was no nail gun. It was basically just um, using the brackets and the system that all comes as a part of the package. So, mate, all in all, a really good uh, product, and thank you so much for your help. Awesome. Cheers, legend. Always, when it comes mate. time to pack up, let's see how long she takes. I've got the stopwatch here. Let's go. Hold on, bring it back. One minute, 56 seconds. Mate, that's a pretty awesome little effort to bring that system down so quick. We're not quite on the back of the truck yet, but we're not far off. And so guys, all in all, I'm really impressed with this conform system. I guess it comes down to three uh, major elements that sort of contribute to make this one a winner. I think it's probably safety, uh, economy, and, and quality. On the so, safety side, I guess you're looking at the fact that, you know, number one, you're not having to handle any power tools whatsoever. So that in itself is a big thing, um, as well as there's no splinters, uh, and you don't have to worry about carting around heavy materials and run the risk of doing it in a back or something like that. And when it comes to quality, I guess, 
The sheer smooth finish of the, of the face of the boards is gonna guarantee a beautiful smooth edge. Um, you're not gonna be getting any sort of indentations that might come in timber, um, and you're guaranteed a beautiful quality edge, which is obviously important for quality work. And then I guess when it comes down to economy as well, number one, the job's gonna take probably half the time to produce and put together the formwork, and the same when pulling it down. So you've saved a pile of money and time straight off the bat there, but then you've also got the economy and having to replace those timber and boards, say every couple of weeks to a month, you might get five to seven jobs um, for a, you know for a normal concreter with your timbers. So the fact that you don't have to replace those boards every few weeks is going to save you a bucket load of time. So all in all, I think the Conform is an awesome winner. So guys, thank you so much for tuning into another BCM Tough Test, and we hope you stay really safe on site, and we'll catch you soon. Bring it back.